Snapper Guardians Coburn Sound is home to the largest known spalling schools of pink snapper in the West Coast bioregion. From Calberry to Augusta, it's schools of fish like this that support safe and fantastic fishing experiences for the community on Perth's doorstep and throughout the West Coast bioregion. That's why in 2015 there was a huge outcry from the wreck fishing community when confronted with this. Here's another one. Eastern side of Garden Island. That's an eight kilo fish, dead as a doornail. We're going to take some of these samples because it's important that we can get these tested to see what's going on out here because it's just not good enough. Thousands of pink snapper had been killed by a microscopic algal bloom and washed up on the shores of the sound to local fishers' shock and dismay. With community emotions running high, Wreckfish West gained the support of hundreds of snapper guardians who helped fund the release of 50,000 pink snapper into Coburn and Warmbra Sounds in early 2016. The Snapper Guardians Community Fish Stocking Program was born. It's 3 a.m. and while most of the city sleeps, the Deep Herd Aquaculture Team heads out into Coburn Sound on a crystal clear Perth spring morning. Mike Harrison and his colleague, Bruce Jindy, are skimming the sound's surface water for pink snapper eggs using these bongo nets. Bruce carefully rinses and sieves the collected eggs to remove seaweed and other larger debris. Back at Deep Herd's Fremantle Marine Finfish Hatchery, Mike and Bruce transport the eggs in oxygenated bags into a tank where they can be counted and checked for quality. This involves examining the egg's buoyancy and analysing the eggs under a microscope. And here's the result. Healthy juvenile pink snapper at 30 days feeding on Artemia marine micro shrimp. At about 80 days old, these fish are nearly ready for release. The fish are transported to Woodman Point in Coburn Sound in a special fish stocking tank funded through recreational fishing licence fees. And here they are, ready for release into the sheltered waters with an army of volunteers, mums, dads and kids, ready to help them on their way. Here we are at Snapper Guardians 2020. Great day with the community. We've got 4,000 pink snapper. They're 90 to 100 days old and the kids and families are about to help us release them into Coburn Sound as part of this great program where we're working with the community, working with the scientists to care for this place that gives us as a rec sector so much. So once again, Wreckfish West are proud to be part of this. We're proud to be driven by the community to deliver great outcomes for Coburn Sound and uh, you know, really looking after Pink Snapper, which are an icon of this part of the world. We're raising him to be all about sustainability because in the future he will be one of the guardians, I guess, like we are today. So, yeah, very important. And this is what it's all about and why the community and Wreckfish West care so much about Coburn Sound. Abundant, healthy pink snapper stocks in Perth's backyard. Help us to protect it forever. I love fishing! I love fishing!